Welcome back. Today, we'll be showing footage for the Boston E3 demo for Assassin's Creed 3, also known as that game that I get beat up in a lot. I'll try to be as traditional with this as possible, but there really isn't a lot to say about this demo. This demo was shown a few times after E3, but before the launch of the game, and as a result, it showed off some functions of the game that were then new features such as stalking zones. This mission that I'll be playing does not actually exist in the retail game. At least as far as I am aware. Feel free to correct me in the comments though. Throughout this mission, there will be spoken dialogue, at which point I'll have some subtitles to display what they would have said if they were uninterrupted. Unlike in the frontier, where weapons were changed automatically, in this demo, you have to change them manually. In the original draft of this video that I was making, I actually didn't know about the woman insulting the guard. That insult actually caused an event. As a result, the game had two guards that were doing absolutely nothing. You look comfortable. Maybe we'll just leave you there for a few days. What did you think would happen? You resist the captain and you get the stock. Pretty simple in my eyes, but I suppose I shouldn't expect much from a monk. Roll of the colonies. Boy, Phil's been hung. This demo may look familiar to people who have been fans since before AC3's launch date as the Wii U demo. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hey, you! Stay right there! He's in the market! Find out and find him! I'm not sure if this demo shows a unique animation for Connor or not when he's pulling down his hood, or if he's just holding his hand in front of his face. I'm also unsure if this animation where Connor is standing and leaning against the wood frame is All unique to this demo. This carriage springs. Dull work, but it's pounds of the purse. Gotta look at it that way, mate. True. True. Maybe I'll hire your apprentice. My apologies for that NPC. This is the part where I get beat up a lot. But it doesn't matter, because my shoes are too tight and I have forgotten how to dance. Also, Connor's HP doesn't get reduced by these attacks, so it really doesn't matter. Running through this next area is going to be an NPC who complains about beats of all things. I'll include his dialogue as text. Here's another conversation. Have you been to one of these coffee shops? I think he went this Not way! Yet. 
I have been wanting to, though. You have? Perhaps you would allow me to accompany you. I mean, I've been to a few of them. I would like that very much. This skill is called Covert Escort. What it does is it acts like Connor is being imprisoned by some NPC Redcoats, but in fact they are assassin Sir. recruits. It's supposed to get you past the blockades of NPC Redcoats. In the E3 demo for Boston, this is actually supposed to stop just after getting through the blockade, but that's really up to the user. There's another conversation here between a woman and a fish salesman. I don't know if they can be heard in this video, then. The Redcoat Captain said, Leave me be, assassin. Killing me won't fix anything. This makes me wonder, did the assassins have more of an important role in AC3 in this draft? What was the fixing that the Captain referenced? Did something happen? Did Connor care any more about that way back then? And that's the end of this demo. I hope you all enjoyed it, and starting next week, we'll have a more extensive look at the three E3 demos. If you'd like me to show the dialogue directly in the game, rather than the annotations, it may be a little difficult, but I can certainly try it for those conversations. Have a great day, and be sure to stay safe.